So the following problem is about two masses that are suspended from a pulley. And I'm going to draw the figure. We can call this one M and that one capital M. Little M, capital M. So we have to analyze the forces in which the mass little m participates using a table that is similar to what you see in uh, chapter five, section three of, uh, of Crowell. So you have to see which forces are acting uh, on each one. So essentially, this is asking you for a free body diagram. So for both M and capital M, little m, big M, you're going to have Mg pulling down and tension pulling up. Those are the free body diagrams of the two masses. And then you have to find the magnitude of the acceleration of the two masses. So directly from the actuational can read it directly from your free body diagram. We don't have a horizontal component in this problem, so we only have to worry about the forces in the vertical direction. So some forces in Y for little m, we have minus mg plus tension equals mass, so little m, times acceleration, in this case the acceleration of little m. And then you have sum of forces in y for big M. And they look pretty similar. So you have minus mg plus tension equals big M times acceleration of big M. And of course, if this one moves up, this one is going to move down at the same rate and vice versa. They are constrained to have the same acceleration because they are joined by, by the ropes, or by the rope. So mathematically, we can say that, let's say that the first one moves up, that's the positive acceleration. So plus AM, this one is going to move down, minus uh, AM. as the acceleration constraint. And we can just call this, you know, A. So then we can replace uh, A for little m, we just call it A. Uh, but A for big M, 
is equal to minus a. So we put the negative in here. Now we can get rid of the subscript. So initially we had three equations, but we just implemented that one into the two to make it look prettier. So the problem is asking us for the acceleration. So we have to solve for the tension first. Tension is MA. This minus becomes plus, plus MG. It's also equal to minus MA, big MA. And so it becomes a plus. So we can solve for this acceleration over here. Move it over here. This one becomes so negative. So A little m plus big M equals G big M minus little m. And here you know, we can switch this one so that it looks pretty. And then we can move this one over here, so that it's just a ratio. So that's the acceleration. To get the tension, we can we have uh, A over here. So we can just plug it in. 